Hi, I'm Ted from EverythingAttachments.com and we're here to show you the bad boy mowers lineup from the, from the mowers to the utility vehicle. Uh, they're made in the United States, Batesville, Arkansas. I've been to the plant several times. It's a beautiful place. It's a family atmosphere. And uh, we're going to show you why we've picked the bad boy mowers over all the other mowers that we've sold in the past and why if you do your homework and look at all the other mowers and compare value to the dollar of what you're getting, why you'll pick a bad boy mower for yourself. On the residential bad boy mower series, you still get a lot of things that are as good as any of the commercial mowers out there. They will, they will warranty this mower for commercial use for one year which no one else will on the residential series. This is a 3 16th steel deck. It's 14 percent thicker than 7 gauge which is the industry standard and this is just the best mower on the market for any residential uh, or even some light commercial cutting use. Residential series you get a 27 horsepower Courage Pro 27 horsepower Kohler that comes standard. You have this model available in a 50 inch cut and a 60 inch cut. I'm here to talk about value. The most mower for the money. And keep in mind that their, their best mower, the biggest mower that they offer is a 35 horsepower four cylinder Caterpillar. It's the biggest one on the market with the most horsepower and it's still only in the $12,000 range. And that's a lot of money, but if you compare it to a Ferris or another mower with a 35 horsepower diesel in it, you're going to find that that is way underpriced. So we're going to start with what I think is the best mower for the money in the commercial mower series. This is a full commercial. This is a pup series. It has a full quarter inch deck on it. Industry standard is 7 gauge. This is quarter inch. That's 40% thicker than 7 gauge. So you've got a deck that's just about indestructible. It uses tractor forged top links here, so you're not going to bend any of that. You've got a forged uh, bracket back here that keeps your deck level. All the pulleys on this unit, if you'll notice, they're made in the USA. They have about twice as many rivets and stuff in the pulleys to keep them from separating as any of the other units that I've seen. This is just a super heavy duty unit, has the four post frame in it. I've never seen one bent or anything like that like I have some of the other mowers. Heck, the floorboard on this mower is thicker than most mower decks. So they're super easy to work on. The tanks come out from both sides, which Bad Boy has the patent on. It has the electric lift on it standard so that you don't have to use a foot operated or do it manually. When you flip the seat up, you've got the tanks out. Just about everything on this mower is just so easy to work on. You've got a two gallon reservoir for your oil. A lot of mowers only having three quarts experience problems with overheating with the hydrostats. You've got dual filters to keep contamination from one side to the other not happening. All their commercial mowers have twin pumps with fans on them to keep them running cool. This is a 23 horsepower Vanguard, 52 inch cut for under $6,200. If you're a homeowner and you're considering buying a zero turn mower and a residential mower may be what you're looking at because you're just a homeowner, if you're mowing three acres, five acres, something like that for no more money than what you're going to go to, you need to definitely consider the first series of the fully commercial bad boy mower. With this mower, the, the value is so, so much better than any other mowers. When you go to look at a mower, I want you to go to any of the major brands, pick whomever you like and keep $6,200 in your mind and then go and ask them for $6,200 what can you get in an industrial series mower and you will run back to the bad boy mower series quick. If you're a commercial mower and you've got three or more machines in your fleet and you plan on replacing them with a bad boy, if you'll call me personally, just ask for Ted. We'll try to come up with a special deal for you where we can get them, get them shipped and delivered to you, save you a little bit of money, and turn the mowers that have been costing you money over the years repairing them uh, into something that is just a lot less maintenance and a lot heavier duty unit for your future next 10 years of use.